The SNCAC NC.70 was a French twin-engine piston-powered attack and torpedo bomber developed shortly after World War II by the Société Nationale de Constructions Aéronautiques du Centre. Conceived in 1946, it represented France's effort to rebuild its aviation industry and close the technological gap created by years of occupation. The NC-1070 was designed to serve as a versatile strike aircraft capable of ground attack, reconnaissance, and anti-ship missions. The aircraft featured an unusual twin-boom configuration with two large engine nacelles extending behind the wings and connected by a pair of horizontal stabilizers. Its mid-mounted wings were sharply tapered with a straight leading edge and curved trailing edge. The fuselage extended well beyond the tail assembly and housed the main bomb bay and rear gun position. The three-man crew consisted of a pilot, a bombardier observer in the glazed nose, and a rear gunner in a turret. Power came from two Gnome Roan 14R24 air-cooled radial engines producing 1,600 horsepower each. The NC.1070 could carry up to 800 kilograms, approximately 1,764 pounds, of bombs or a single torpedo beneath the fuselage. Fixed armament included four 20mm cannons mounted in the nose. Its robust tricycle landing gear was fully retractable and the main gear units were positioned within the engine booms. The aircraft also featured folding wings, catapult fittings, and arrestor gear for potential carrier operations. The first prototype took flight on the 23rd of May 1947, piloted by Fernand Lazen. Early tests showed promising performance, with a top speed of about 580 km per hour, approximately 360 miles per hour, and a range exceeding 3,000 km, around 1,864 miles. However, the landing gear proved weak and structural reinforcements were required. On the 9th of March 1948, the prototype was badly damaged in a belly landing at tussus le noble effectively ending development. By that time, the French Air Force had lost interest in piston engine designs, turning instead toward jet propulsion. SNCAC redirected its efforts to the NC-1071, a jet-powered evolution of the same airframe equipped with Rolls-Royce Neen engines. The NC-1071 became France's first twin-engine jet aircraft, but it too failed to reach production. Today, no parts of the NC-1070 survive, but its development marks an important transitional phase in post-war French aviation, bridging the era between piston-driven bombers and the dawn of jet-powered combat aircraft.